so it can talk to the internet, it can get power. I can't interact with it yet, though, so I'm going to need input peripherals, such as the ever-useful keyboard. There will be a tutorial just on this thing coming up soon. Keep your eyes out for that. Uh, most of these guys connect via USB. Looks like that. Some USB ports on the back here, so we'll plug that right in. And uh, by the way, if you're ever working with a computer, you're trying to plug something into whatever port or another, and you notice it takes a lot of force to go in, that means you're doing it wrong. Stop, check everything, take another look at it, and try again. Because uh, especially with USBs, it's really easy to try and put them in upside down, and then you, you push that hard enough, you're going to break it. Not recommended. Keyboard's plugged in. I can type. Next, the mouse. And yes, as I said earlier, I want to be able to teach you what to do, even if you're seeing a mouse for the first time, so there will be a tutorial just about this guy coming up as well. Mouse also connects via USB. 